The main difference between Fleming's left-hand rule and Fleming's right-hand rule lies in their applications and the type of energy conversion they describe. Fleming's left-hand rule is used for electric motors, where electrical energy is converted into mechanical energy. It helps determine the direction of motion when a current flows through a conductor in a magnetic field. In this rule, the left-hand thumb represents the direction of motion, force. The forefinger represents the direction of the magnetic field, from north to south, and the middle finger represents the direction of current flow, positive to negative. This rule is applied in devices like electric fans, motors in electric vehicles, and robotic arms. On the other hand, Fleming's right-hand rule is used for generators, where mechanical energy is converted into electrical energy. It determines the direction of the induced current when a conductor moves in a magnetic field. In this rule, the right-hand thumb represents the motion of the conductor, the forefinger represents the magnetic field direction, and the Middle finger represents the induced current direction. This principle is used in power plants, bicycle dynamos, wind turbines, and alternators in cars. In summary, the left-hand rule applies to motors, which require electrical input to create motion, while the right-hand rule applies to generators, which produce electricity from motion. Both rules are essential in understanding electromagnetic interactions in modern technology. If you want to see these principles in action, Try experimenting with small motors or generators and observe how electricity and motion interact. Keep exploring the wonders of electromagnetism and discover how these rules power the world around us. If you like the content like, share and subscribe.